So there is a million things I'd rather be doing than playing a mouse and cat game with the Slenderman, who by the way terrifies me. But this is Halloween and I'm gonna do it anyway. It all happened a few years ago. My daughter and I were taking a carriage along an old abandoned road and, to our delight, had finally reached a settlement. We decided to spend the night here. There was a long road ahead of us. But we never imagined how long it would actually be. At night, I was awakened by some noises. The room was still empty, windows closed, the doors bolted shut. I didn't even understand at first that Lisa was simply gone. After searching for her and the inn proved unsuccessful, I tried asking the locals to see if anyone saw her, though to no avail. But what I did learn was that Lisa wasn't the first child to disappear. I've also learned about a detective who was searching for them, and even managed to return a few back home. I was told about a former local landlord's castle, where the detective was headed next. Gathering my courage, I went after him. Maybe he could help me in my search, or at least... I could use some of the clues he may have found. Hey guys, Triple Ben Gaming here. Just want to say welcome. Today we're playing Slenderman Origins 2, which is the sequel to one of the most successful horror games on mobile. You guessed it, Slenderman, the original. Uh, it's available on Android and iOS for $5. There is a playable demo, which is free to play, and I'll leave the links in the description below. So there is a lot of uh, puzzle solving in this game, as well as uh, the, the horror side of meeting the Slenderman, which is a terrifying creature, I gotta say. Okay, so here there, we can use a hint if we're lost. Great to know. Alright, got it. So it plays from the first person perspective. And uh, you don't have any weapons or... Not yet, at least. So we're playing as a guy whose daughter went missing. And we went looking for a detective to help us out. And that's the reason uh, why we're in this dungeon. It's 1.44 a.m. I'm alone and I have the lights off. And I have the, my headphones on for maximum fear effect. For your enjoyment only. <laughs> Alright, so we just picked up something. I'm guessing it's gonna have to do with that big door in the center of the room. Ooh, that was a creepy <laughs> sound. The reader collected notes. Yeah, we also picked up a note. Let's check it out. You can pause the video if you want to read. Okay, let's go ahead and check the door. Alright, so there are four uh, blocks. Or four keys required to open it. We have one so far, three to go. Let's look for them. What is that shiny thing? What the hell was that noise? Am I being watched? I feel like I'm being watched. A note let's check it out just as I thought the four holes in the door are some sort of lock right okay closet is empty let's check out the back area of the room I'm curious to know guys what is your favorite scary movie of all times let me know in the comment section below mine will either be uh, Hannibal oh we found something cool Either Hannibal or the Saw movies. And I recently just finished watching this TV show called The Following, which is pretty good in my opinion. If you're into thrillers, murders, and cults and whatnot, you, you would really enjoy it. Uh, give it a try. And if you do give it a try, let me know in the comment section what you think. And it's uh, starring Kevin Bacon, who is amazing, by the way. All right, so we have two missing pieces to open the door. Let's go ahead and put that piece that we just found. There you go. 
I wonder where the Slenderman is. Probably something I shouldn't be wondering. Oh, the third piece. Sweet. No, that's not it. So we just picked up uh, the third missing piece or key. Put it right there. And it's... Uh, Oh, we gotta go the back. I don't have a good feeling about this, guys. Um, I just... I can feel something. What is... What the hell is that? Are you guys seeing that? Holy shit. Way ahead is blocked by a monster. No kidding. Use the shield button. Okay, so we can uh, drive him away by using the shield. Let's do that. I do not want to go face to face with that thing. What the hell was that? Oh shit 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 shit! Did we die? Are we dead? No, we're back right where we were. I don't know what just happened. Maybe the developers just teasing us. I don't like that developers. Not one bit. Okay, so let's uh, quickly... What the... What was that? Did you guys hear that? Or am I just hearing things? It, it doesn't matter, let's hurry up. Corpses. This guy looks like he wanna give me a hug. No, thank you! So this game is part of a Halloween Scariest Games playlist I'm doing. I'll leave a link at the end of this video if you haven't seen... Oh, we found the, the last the missing key. I'll leave a, a link at the end of this video if you guys want to check out the other games there aren't many games or I should say there aren't many good horror games on, on iOS and Android but I really picked out the best and the scariest alright let's go ahead and uh, put that last missing stone key in the door and get the hell out of here and there's something I wanted to ask you guys every, every year when Halloween comes I find myself wondering, should I buy or slash rent a costume or make it myself? So I would love to know your opinion. What do what you like? What do you prefer to do? Let me know in the comments section. From the Nameless Detective's notes. I had a hunch that something was wrong with this castle, but I never imagined the actual scale of thing going on here. A giant dungeon, a crypt filled with secrets, mysteries, and corpses. Stone stairs first take you deep down, and then from platform to platform. Outside the rooms, I can't even see the dungeon ceiling. I'm pretty sure terrible things happen here, and that I'll find something. Some clue or hint there. And that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed the panic attack the Slenderman almost gave me. If you did, give it a thumbs up and let me know in the comment section. Also, you can check out some of my other videos and I would love to have you subscribe as well. And until next time, keep playing.